Hogs that back with you. So we're gonna be putting the wires on to the 68 Caprice right now. So we got these uh, lug nuts from, um, what is it, wheel, wheel Lug Nut King. So um, we already got this car jacked up a little bit right now. I already took off all the knockoffs and everything and we're gonna get this tire off real quick. So if you give me a sec, um, I'll do that all with you guys. So give me a sec. Okay, so let's get this tire off you guys. Right. Remember safety first, you guys. You know, put that emergency brake on to keep this all going. But I'm going to show you how you actually have to put these on. Because uh, these wheels, you can actually have them on a five and five on a glass house, or you can have them on the five and four and three quarters. So I'll show you that real quick here. So get that off. Normally I'd clean behind it, but I'm recording, so I just want to show you guys real quick. But um, if you guys see right here, it's not even lined up at all. There's a hell of a gap. But this is what you use. These little bushings that go inside. Wheel Lug Nut King on uh, eBay has them. They're the ones that carry them for the appliance. And I think True Spokes too, I'm not really sure. But uh, these are the tapered nuts here. 7 sixteenths, but um, let me go get a screwdriver real quick, you guys. Hold on a sec. Okay, so with these wheels and everything, you see how there's that gap right there and all that. I usually just get a screwdriver and just lift it up a little bit. And just rock it wherever it needs to be. right there put the bushing in and then it places itself pretty much right there and since it's already sitting on top get it all perfect first hold on a second guys just to get the seat right right there and then get the lug nut on there let's see if I can even do this Usually I'd be sitting on my ass doing this, but I'm not. Let's see. Now let's get another one. Might just get it started in there as soon as it's in. to get it started and lined up because it'll line up all the other ones in there you don't have to tighten it all the way because you're still gonna have to rock it and get it for the next one so just have a little loose there but you see how that's kind of lined up in there I don't know if you guys can see let me try to get closer here all right there you see how it lines itself up pretty much if you leave this one loose and then you get another one move it to a different spot Get the screwdriver again, like I said, and just lift it up, and it's in. See what I mean? Do another one right here at the top, and this will give it like a three-point here. So I'll lift again. See, and then they just fit. So let's see if we can get all this all done with you guys. These aren't annoying as hell, though. Started there. Let's get this other one in here. Let me get this out too. I know you guys are probably gonna say something in the comments about, oh, you're taking forever to do that, and you know it, it sucks. But whatever. <laughs> So that one's in. And like I said, as soon as you get a like a 
right across from each other, then they'll all just line up. Okay, I see, that's done. Now the rest will line up perfectly. You don't even need to separate it. Get that last one in. on there like I said they all line up with each other I'll come back and get that one later That's pretty much it, you guys. Yeah, like I said, I'll get that on after. So that's pretty much it, you guys. I'll touch on TV. I'll talk to you guys later.